Hi everybody, John Paul Brionis here from InMotion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our WHM series. Today I'm going to show you how to change your root password in WHM. Alright, begin by logging into WHM as root. If you're not familiar with what root is, or if you want to know how to gain root access to your server, then a pop-up will come up on the screen. Click that pop-up and it'll go to our full article on what is and how to obtain root access. But go ahead and log into your WHM as root. Once you've logged in, we're going to select server configuration from this main menu. And that's this button here. When you click that, you're going to see a change root password button here. Let's go ahead and click that. Once you get on the change root password page, you're going to see two password fields here. You can enter a password in each box, the same password, twice, and that's just to confirm that it is the same password and that would set your password. I'm going to use this password generator just to be safe. And I, I prefer using the password generator because it creates more complex passwords typically. But make sure you copy whatever password you're putting in there. Check the box to say you've copied it and then click the use password button. It'll fill in the password that it, that it created there. And I really, make, um, I really recommend using a very strong password especially when it comes to root access to your VPS or dedicated server, you really want it to be strong so that it can take care of your site or your server. Sorry, so it could take care of your server. Uh, once you've entered it pa twice, hit the change password button. You'll see this notification saying the password for root has been changed. And then it tells you the username there. At this point, your password for root has been changed. Uh, keep in mind that if you change your root password, which we do recommend doing regularly, that you um, you should let the InMotion Hosting Support Department know. And essentially, it's just so that in case we need access to your server or if there's something wrong, um, it is part of our Terms of Service Agreement. Once you've set the password and, and created it, I recommend logging out and then going ahead and trying to log in back with the new password. And you see it let me back in, so that means the password was accepted. Thank you for joining us for another video in our WHM series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Did you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? There's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.